Your Natchez History Minute is brought to you by Natchez National Historical Park. Dr. Lloyd Tevis Miller was born in Natchez, Mississippi on this day, December the 6th, in 1872. He was the son of Washington Miller, a hackman or cab driver, and his wife, Emily. Dr. Miller was one of the few African-American physicians in Mississippi and established a medical practice in Yazoo City in the late 1890s. In 1900, Dr. Miller was a co-founder, along with a dozen other doctors, of the Mississippi Medical and Surgical Association, the state's largest and oldest organization representing African-American health professionals. In 1928, T.J. Huddleston established the Afro-American Hospital in Yazoo City to provide medical services for the Afro-American sons and daughters, a statewide fraternal insurance organization that provided death and hospitalization benefits to its members. Dr. Miller was chosen as the hospital's first medical director. While the facility's mission was primarily to serve its members, it was also available to the general public. This hospital provided services for African Americans not only in Yazoo City and the Mississippi Delta, but all across the South. During the 1930s and 1940s, the hospital, under Dr. Miller's direction, also operated a state-licensed nursing school. Dr. Miller died in March of 1951. I'm Fran Farmer, a respiratory therapist at Merritt Health Natchez, and this has been your Natchez History Minute.